guys, it's Kristen with another Chance Resale. Welcome back to another Friday purse sale video. Um, in addition to thrifted purses for sale, we have a couple pairs of shoes and a really cool jacket that I found and I couldn't leave it behind. We also have two Goodwill Blue Box mystery purse boxes to open as well. So if you see anything that you're interested in, you can email me at another chance resale one at gmail.com. All my information's always down in the description box, so please check that if you have any questions. Um, I will have a sold list down in the comments section, so once you finish watching the video, if you would just refresh the video so that the um, most up-to-date sold list is down in the comment section for you. Just check that out before you email me. It just helps with the amount of emails I get and being, back, and being able to get back to you guys as fast as I can. All right, so if you haven't bought from me before, just give me your PayPal email and mailing address in the email when you request your items. Uh, please include a timestamp and a brief description of the items you're interested in. Um, and I think that's it. So let's, let's start out with the clearance section. So these are purses from last week that didn't sell and I dropped the price by, you know, five, 10, maybe even $20. So the first one is the Betsy suitcase. So we had the Velour Betsy, like fuchsia star print, um, brand new with tags, Betsy suitcase, luggage. It has a $108 price tag on it. You have the little floof ball here and it's faux leather. You have the pocket, and then the part here that you can put your suitcase um, handle through, like so. And it's in perfect condition. You even have a removable, sh adjustable shoulder strap with the Betsy on it, okay? And it's a zipper closure. And the interior, I took out the stuffing this time. And there's your uh, zipper and you have some slips over there. All right, this is very, it's not very large, but it's a good size. <laughs> and we're dropping it to $55. Okay, then we had the really cool Brighton. I've never seen this uh, style Brighton before. It is leather, it's like a pewter, dark silver. You have a little tassel, which is your um, pull for the zipper. Here is your Brighton hang tag. This is in like new condition. Everything on it is absolutely gorgeous. It's a cute little um, shoulder bag with the zipper closure. And the interior is just as nice as the exterior. There's your Brighton Creed and your zipper pocket there. So really nice condition, really nice Brighton bag, and we're gonna drop it to $60. So pretty. Like new condition. Okay, then we had the vintage Jennifer Moore leather shoulder bag. And it even still has all the original tags, even Macy's. And it is genuine leather. It has kind of like a pleated look with the white stripes. Excellent, excellent. It is new. I know sometimes even new bags can have flaws, but I didn't see any on this one. So there's your interior. It's also leather, which is great and easy cleaning. There's your zipper pocket. And this one we are going to drop to $24. Okay, super cute. Next we had the little Crabtree and Evelyn um, clutch. This is faux leather. You had the cute little um, tassel. You can use this for makeup or as an actual, you know, evening clutch. You unzip it, it has rose gold um, hardware. And then you have the Crabtree and Evelyn there. So just something cute. And we're going to drop this one to $10. Hi, Dallas. You coming to smell everything again? <laughs> Hi. There's no room on the couch for you right now, but maybe in a little bit. So next we had the Vera Pink. 
pink and white uh, crossbody, or this could be adjusted to a, actually, yes, it could be adjusted to a shoulder bag. You have a zipper pocket here, slip there, zipper in the back. This one was in excellent, excellent condition, zipper closure. There's your contrast interior with the um, slip pocket. So this one we are dropping to $25. Then we had the Elliot Luca, the white, or it's like a kind of like off-white leather with the beautiful uh, floral print. It is a crossbody bag. And these are functioning pockets here in the front, the back. Um, zipper closure with a bright pink zipper pocket and slips on that side. And this one did have um, a couple small marks right there. Um, a little teeny bit right here, a little bit on the back. Probably just some transfer, maybe someone had black jeans on. But other than that, it's really cute. Love the print on it. And we're dropping this one to $20. Then we had the Marciano pink and purple um, leather baguette shoulder bag with a uh, gold tone chain handle. All right, super nice, super cool. Um, it's kind of like, it's got like vintagey vibes to it and it's got this big, um, you know, plate with the name tag. Um, this one did have a little bit of a mark on the back right there. But other than that, this bag was in beautiful condition. You just pop it open and there's your interior. Very nice condition. Okay, and this one we are going to drop to $50. Okay, $50 on the Marciano. Then we had the Cole Haan jewelry wallet. Leather, it's like a gold metallic. Super de duper nice condition and you just open it up and this you can use for like your you know your super expensive jewelry or something maybe you want to keep in your wallet I mean in your purse on the plane you don't want to put it in your luggage and risk getting it lost you know you can put your earrings like studs up there this pocket goes all the way down maybe some you know bracelets or um, bigger earrings you can put stuff in here that actually can be attached in there, maybe some necklaces. You have this loop here you can attach some necklaces or bracelets to, and then you have this here for more earrings if you would like, I think. <laughs> okay, so this one we are dropping to $18. Okay, super cute. And then we have, okay, so lastly, we have all the Squishmallows. So none of those sold. So the first one we had was uh, Origin, Origin, I guess his name is, the orange. And we're going to drop this guy to $10. He actually goes for over 20 bucks, like 25 to 30 online. Um, so 10 on him. Then Lucia the lemur. We're going to drop to five. And then the Hugs and Squishies Squirrel or whatever he is, is gonna be five as well. Okay, so then we had the few purses from America's Thrift Supply. So the first one that we have left is the um, white uh, faux Safiano leather backpack. There's no branding, but it has this V on the front and it is gold tone. This bag was in really nice condition. It has the adjustable straps. Really nice. It is super structured. It's just a little bent out of shape because I didn't stuff it. Um, you have the handle on the top. When you open it up, it's a double snap and drawstring. There was just a little bit of discoloration right there on the zipper and your slips. But other than that, it was in really nice shape. So this is super cute, winter white, and we're going to do 30, to, oh wait, $10, $10. I skipped one. <laughs> I skipped the Montana West. 
Okay, so this one I had a question about in the last video when I opened it and a lot of you gave me the answer. So this cool pocket in the back is actually for your pistol. It is for concealed carry and this is the holster for a pistol. I should have known because I have my permit and I can have a concealed carry pistol, but I just wasn't thinking that. So um, it can be um, Velcroed into the back pocket here. So, you know, it's not gonna fall out or anything, but it does zipper, both sides do zipper. It is a faux leather, but it is in beautiful condition. Okay, um, all the rhinestones and studs are here on the front and on the straps. Um, there was just a little bit of wear right there and right there. Um, but other than that, I think it was good. So it had the three compartments on the inside. One, the middle section is zippered. You have the zipper pocket here with your Montana West. And then this side has a slip. It is a zipper closure. And it was a really cool bag to get. So we're gonna drop this one to $30. Okay, then we had the Fossil. This is the black leather with brown stitching Fossil. This was in really excellent condition as well. You have the um, front pocket here. You have two side pockets, the back, the bottom. I don't know why you, I don't know why you're barking, Dally. The key fob little hang tag. It is a zipper closure. And then your interior was very nice. Super nice in there. There's your fossil logo with the zipper and your slips. Super nice, nice medium size, and we're dropping it to $20. And then lastly, from the America's Thrift Supply uh, mystery box, I had gotten a Tommy Hilfiger. This is um, pink and brown, faux leather. These are functioning pockets. It is like a canvas, nylon-y type material. It is in excellent condition. Um, even the strap and everything, zipper closure. And oops, and the interior was very nice as well. Zipper up there, slips, some card slots. Okay, so this one we're gonna drop to just $10. Okay, so that wraps up the clearance section. Now we are gonna go into some pers um, some shoes and then I have this really cool jacket that I picked up and I really hope somebody loves it and purchases it because it's really cool. So it's by Zara. I might have to back the camera up a little bit to show you. Ugh. Let's see. Look at this. You have the horses on the front, you see it? And it's like this really um, soft, like fleecy fur. It's not real fur, it's more like, um, like a fleece, but not really, I don't know what you would call it. But the back, I mean, look at this, you guys. Okay, it has a nice high collar. It has a, a nice big zipper. You have pockets. It is in excellent condition. You can drawstring the bottom so it is tight around your body if you would like. So this is a USA small medium. However, it's oversized. So, This on me is a little bit big, but it's oversized, it's supposed to be. So, let me see if I can back you guys up 
even more. I'm 5'4", about 135 pounds. Oh wait, there's something in the pocket. A large bobby pin. <laughs> so this fits me a little big, all right? So this jacket, I did the measurements. It's 29 inches long and zippered from armpit to armpit is 23 inches, which is actually a large. So this is a little bit big on me, but if you like the oversized fit, it's awesome. All right, now I have to take it off because I'm sweating. So um, I really like this jacket, but like I said, it's a little bit big for me. Where did I put the hanger? Um, so like I said, this would fit anyone from a small, it would be oversized to a medium, but it would fit um, large comfortably, like normally. So I'm going to ask $45 for the Zara horse um, fleecy faux fur. <laughs> okay. If you need more measurements, just let me know. You can email me if you want the sleeve measurement or the shoulder to shoulder. Just let me know. Okay, so now let's do the shoes. I only have a few pairs. And let's bring you guys in a little bit more. And the first pair of shoes are so cool, you guys. I picked them up because they were really nice looking. And they're coach. They're actually coach. Not that you can see that. It says coach on the top there. They are a size eight, which is actually my size. Oh, I broke my ring. Oh, doo doo. All right, I just bent it, that's okay. All right, so coach. These are a size eight. Oh, I didn't measure the heel. I would say that's four inches, easily. They don't, they don't come with laces. I had thought originally that maybe they were missing them, but I did look these up and they come just like this. So size eight, four inch wedge heel, um, suede boots, coach, and we're gonna do $48. Super cute. Then we have switching to a completely opposite season, Vionic. I always buy Vionic when I see them and they're a decent price. Even though it's fall in New York, it's summer somewhere, right? So um, these are a wedge uh, comfort sandal. Uh, Vionics or comfort shoes, orthopedics. They have a buckle, and these two straps are uh, Velcro. And these are a size 10. Really excellent condition. And I'm going to ask $25. Now the the shoes are not going to be, the shoes in the jacket are not going to be in next week's clearance section if there's anything left. Um, after this, they're, go they're gonna be listed. So um, for like at least 10 to $20 more, maybe even $30 more, depending on you know what it is. Like the um, coach boots I'll probably list for around 75. Um, so if you guys see the shoes or the jacket, buy it now because it does not, it will not make the clearance video. All right, then we have a pair of Skechers. These are really nice, and if you guys ever get to see, um, ever get to find Skechers that are really nice condition and a really good price, pick them up because Skechers are the number one selling shoe brand in the country. Okay, Skechers, these are size 11. They are in, I mean, they probably were worn like maybe two times. Size 11, they're like a grayish. They look, they're coming off more blue like my shirt, but they are gray. Okay, super nice condition. 
They are the Memory Foam Relaxed Fit, size 11, and I'm going to ask $20. Then we have, these are so cute. If these were in my size, I'd definitely keep them. Look at how cute these are. These are Dolce Vita. I do pick up Dolce Vita when I can and when they're you know a good price and they're decent condition because they are cute. They're always super cute. They make real, real leather shoes and super cute ones and really great quality. So um, these are a green and beige snake print. <coughs> Excuse me. And they have this little like fringe on the top and they have like a really cool like um, heel shape. And there is just a little bit of, you know, dirt or something on the heel. But other than that, these are in super nice condition. They have the inner, the inner zippers. And these are a size six. Perfect for the season, size six, and I'm going to ask $25. Leather, green, and beige snake print. Then lastly, I have a pair of J. Crew mules. These are so cute. When I walked by these in the thrift store, I'm like, I have to get those. They are absolutely beautiful. And I think that you can wear these any time of the year because the print is dark, but it has like a light flower on it, so it can bring you through all year. Um, and J. Crew obviously makes very well-made stuff. These are a size nine and a half. There's just a little bit of wear on the toes right there, but not on the fabric part of the toes. Um, they're obviously a slip-on mule, and they go down far on the foot, so you know they're not gonna just like fly off your foot. Most of your foot is gonna be covered, basically right up until the front of your ankle. Um, so nine, size nine, I'm sorry, nine and a half, nine and a half, I don't know what I said before. Uh, mule and we're going to do $28 super cute okay so with that being done now we get into the thrifted purse section you guys I didn't really find that many purses this week um, the thrift stores were kind of dry so um, I do have you know a fair amount but it's definitely not as much as I usually get so you know can't win them all and you, you just gotta Deal with what the thrift stores give you, right? So the first one, I did find two B. Mikowskis, and they are really nice. Um, it's, it's great that I'm finding them because they're no longer being made. Um, so here is the first one. It is a patent leather, uh, beige, purple, and black um, cheetah print. You have the B. Mikowski hang tag long like longer uh, double straps you have your little pouch pocket here like usual and then you have nope okay so just the pouch pocket you this side has another pocket big one this purse is in beautiful condition absolutely gorgeous condition i couldn't find barely any wear on it so it has a magnet closure but what's cool is not only do you have your main compartment with your slips and zipper there, but you have these two compartments that zipper on the top inside that go all the way down the bag. And you have another one over here. So you can keep, you know, keys in one side, phone in the other. So it's like, you know, away from all your other stuff in there if you want or however you want to do it. But you have the um, studs down the sides. Super, super nice bag. And we're going to do this one for $48. Okay. Then the other one I got is black. It's a beautiful and buttery black leather. You have the top handle, but you also have the long strap that can be adjusted longer to be a crossbody. It's beautiful and black butter leather with the pockets on each side. 
You have your signature little pouch pocket in the back here. There is very, very, very minimal wear to the corners. And then, um, oh, the turn lock here. The gold is pretty okay, but the this uh, gunmetal color, let's see what's going on here. You can see there is a little bit of wear to that. Then you're gonna pop it open. And you have three compartments. So um, you have the middle compartment that's zippered. It's gonna be a little difficult to show you. I'll try my best. Zipper, close, zipper pocket slips, nothing on the other side. And then like I said, you have the middle zippered compartment. Excellent condition on the interior. Super minimal wear on the exterior. And we're going to do this one for $45. Okay, then we have a beautiful um, leather tool, like almost like a tooled leather purse by Gabriel S. Look at that. It is beige and these sections here inside are like a gold metallic. There's the sides. Absolutely beautiful. Bottom. And so the handle is, is fine, but the wrapping on this one just got a little bit separated. So it's not coming off or anything. It just, you know, moved and it's caused a little bit of separation but it's fine otherwise. Um, you do have these two pulls on the sides that you can pull the bag shut if you would like. If not, you don't have to. And then the interior is one big open space. There's your Gabriel S logo with your card slots, zipper, and a little slip pocket and nothing on the other side. Super unique bag, absolutely gorgeous. I think I would draw string it closed a little bit. Look at that. Gorgeous for any season of the year. And we're gonna do $60. Okay, then we have a Banana Republic. This one is leather. This is like a green, beige, gold, and brown. and it is slouchy. You have a beautiful matte, kind of like a brushed gold tone hardware. The handle is just single. It is the same on both sides. Super, super minimal wear, if any, on the bottom and corners. It is a magnet closure. And then your interior is one big compartment. There's your Banana Republic. There's a little bit of discoloration in the letters. Um, zipper pocket. Uh, slip on that side. It's gonna be a little hard if I can get... It's really nice in there. Very minimal wear. Super cute. This is another bag that can carry you all year long based on the color. And we're gonna do 45 on it. Then we have a, okay, let's bring these guys closer. We have a Coach Black. This one is so cute. It is black leather. It is absolutely gorgeous. It's more of like a small to medium bag. You have the top handles here, but you also have the shoulder strap that can be removed if you don't want it. It's in excellent condition. The bag is in beautiful shape. Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. Gold hardware, zipper closure, and a beautiful red interior. There's a little bit of spotting down there. 
you have a the Creed and your zipper and your slips over there. Super pretty, very classy bag, and we're going to do $60. Should we do a thumbnail? Haven't done one of those in a while. Let me get rid of that. There we go. Okay. <laughs> then we have another coach. This is silver. See now we're kind of washed out a little bit. There we go. Um, this is a like silver metallic quilted coach purse, kind of like a medium style. Um, you have a pocket on the front. The clasp has a little bit of wear to it, see right there? But you just pop that open, you have your pocket. Back, corners and bottom have super minimal wear. Hardly any wear, if any. Um, the, the handles do have very slight wear to it, just from like the oils on your hands. But as you can see, you really can't tell. And the hardware, everything's really nice. You have a zipper closure, and then there's your interior with the Creed and zipper and your slips. Gorgeous. Again, another bag that can be an every season bag or maybe just fall and winter. It is silver metallic leather and it's gonna be $50, five zero. Okay, then, <laughs> you guys, this bag, I saw it sitting on the shelf and I was like, that is so cute. That is such a unique purse. I really hope one of you guys like it as much as I did. Look at how cute. Look at this. Just look at it. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's been in a barky mood lately. So it's both sides. You have the, um, oh, it's the mailman. Maybe. The tortoise shell handles. And you have a little beading in the center there. It's made by a brand called Mod, M-O-D. Handmade in Vietnam. But I just thought it was absolutely adorable. It's like a 3D flower. And then the interior has a, a snap closure and you have a interior. So let me see, where's my phone? There you go. It fits. <laughs> so this little cutie is going to be $25. I think if you carry this, it, you are gonna get noticed and people are going to compliment you because it is just so cool. All right. Next up, we have all the purses down here. So let me just grab them quickly. I would, won't have to pause you guys. And then we can keep going and then do the Goodwill blue box, blue boxes. All right, so up next, we have a really cute Vera Bradley. It's kind of like a dark denim um, and faux leather crossbody bag. It Someone did have it knotted at the top, so you can either knot it again to make it a little shorter or just leave it and this will, you know, come out. But it is in really nice condition. You have the pocket, zipper pocket here on the front. Plain back. Excellent, excellent. On the corners and everything, zip it open. And you have your cute interior with some card slots and a slip pocket, super cute size. Where'd I put my phone? Where'd it go? I just had it. And it will fit. Dally, what's the matter, baby? So this one is going to be, 
where are we? $30. Okay, then we have a Vera pink and purple and brown and white and green <laughs> and gray crossbody. And this one again is in amazing condition. You have a zipper pocket on the front. You have a pouch pocket on the back. You pop it open and you can put your ID here if you want. And then you have a zipper closure interior with some card slots. Always do the phone test. <laughs> All right, so this one is $25. All right, then we're gonna turn the page and we're gonna do a Kipling. Beautiful fall color. It is a um, shoulder bag or crossbody. You can adjust it right there. It does come with the monkey. You can take him off if you don't like it. Um, but that's like their little signature thing for Kipling. You have all these zipper pockets here. Nothing on the back. This one's in really nice condition. Then you have two zipper compartments on the top. This one has a little key fob and a little slips. And then your other compartment has your Kipling and a zipper. If it fits, it fits. And this one we're going to do $25. Then we have, this one I grabbed mainly for the color and the contrast strap. It's just a faux leather bag by a brand called Adorned. You have a little pocket up front, nothing on the back. This is in like, like new condition. It is faux leather, but look at the cool strap. Remember I talked about doing guitar straps for, strap, for purse straps? This is kind of like what I meant. So you have this really cool, bright, like contrasted strap. It came with the purse. This is not, you know, I don't know if it's a, you know, guitar strap, but I bought it like this. And um, you can adjust it to be shoulder or cross body. And let me just get it open. There we go. And for this one, oh, I didn't show you the inside. So this one we're going to do $24. All right, and then we have this cool Lily Pulitzer iPad. I'm pretty sure it's for an iPad mini case. little pocket maybe for uh, earbuds or something um, there is there was a little mark right there but other than that she's good super cute so this measures 10 inches by eight and a half in case anyone needs to make sure their iPad or tablet will fit and we're going to do $20 then we have Oh, I think I, I think I skipped this. I think this was supposed to be in the clearance section. This is the fossil wallet with the leather trim, black and brown. Yeah, I think this was supposed to be, whoops, oopsies. Two cash slots, all these pockets. Um, and then the back, you have the zipper. Really nice condition, and we're gonna do $10 on this one. I think I forgot that. Okay, then we have the Fossil Card Wallet, card holder. It's that coated canvas that Fossil likes to do. Excellent condition, ID, you have some card slots here, here, 
here, here, and then you have a money slot. Okay, super cute. And we're gonna do $12. Then we have the, oh, I picked this up because I like the style of it. Not because of the name or anything, I just thought the style was super cool. This is <clears throat> Nicole Miller, but it's just an eyeglass case. I don't think um, sunglasses will fit in here unless they're like very small and sleek. But I just like the style of this case. It's like bumpy. Jeez, that is so bright. But now you can't see anything. It's in really nice condition. And then check out the interior. <laughs> How nice is that? It's like a velour, felty green. So I just thought that was cool. Um, if you need a case for your eyeglasses, I thought this was really cool and stylish. Um, and we're gonna do $10. Then we have a Coach wallet in brown, brown uh, fabric and leather. Super nice condition. That is a little, one little boo-boo right there in the fabric. You have a pocket on the back. It says coach right there. Okay, so you have your coach there. You have card slots, you have a slot here. And then you have a slot here, a zipper slot here. And then slots in the back. Okay, and this one we're going to do $20. Then we have another coach wallet, but this is for checkbooks. So this one has just a little bit of discoloration, a little teeny stain right there. And I think there was another one somewhere. I did clean it, so it may have come out. Yeah, I think we're good. But it's the black fabric and leather. Excellent condition. You have the zipper on the back. Okay, so you can put your checkbook um, back in here, uh, all your card slots, your ID, slot here, slot here. There's your uh, made in China there your coach logo in the back of the ID wallet, ID thing. Now there are a few ink marks on top here and there in the center. So I'm gonna just do $20 on this one, otherwise it'd probably be more like 30. So 20 on the coach checkbook wallet. And then we have, I picked this up because I just thought it was really cute and well made. Um, it is a snake print. I'm not sure if it's leather. There's no tags, but it is like a snake print Almost like that eel skin um, fa uh, Fabric like material and you have it's just a little coin pouch. You have a little pouch in the front The back is blank and then you have your main compartment And that's it. I just thought it was really cute and uh, you can put it in your purse Maybe put chapsticks in it or something or lipsticks and we're gonna do 10 bucks. And then last but not least, I have a Michael Kors little hat with a fuzzy on it. A little uh, beanie hat. For $12. And then I have the matching gloves if you would like for $12. Um, I believe they're new, um, you know, they're still attached. I don't see any like signs of wear or anything. Uh, so $12 each in case you don't want both. So you got the gloves and the hat, $12 each. Okay, that wraps it up. So now let's get into the Goodwill Blue Box Mystery Purse Boxes. So make sure you guys check the sold list. When you're done watching the video, refresh the page so you get the most up-to-date sold list. Um, and any questions you may have, it's probably answered if you check out the description box. 
under the video, you just have to click more or the little drop down or whatever it looks like on whatever device that you're on. Um, so now the thing with the Goodwill blue boxes is it's in a bag because I needed the box to do some shipping. So I didn't have a box to put it in instead. So I had my husband, I had Kyle just, I was like, don't let me see it, but I need the box. So just put it in a garbage bag and I'll have to just open it on camera like that. So he opened up the box, he gave me the box, and he put the purses into a garbage bag, tied the garbage bag, and then handed it to me. So I did, did not look, I do not know what's in here, but that's just so you guys know why it's, I'm pulling purses out of a garbage bag. <laughs> All right, so um, these are available on warnnotwasted.com and also, on Goodwill Blue Box's website, they are all, I don't know what's going on. I think they're in the midst of like changing things around because sometimes they're available during the week. Sometimes they're available only on Fridays at the 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time drop. So who knows what's going on? If you know, let everyone else know down in the comments. But I was able to grab this box. I think it was on a Thursday. So let's open it up and see what I got. All right, I told him to put the invoice on top. So here it is. Okay, it just says congrats on your purchase and everything. So yes, yeah, so it says, oh, this is just, oh no, two, okay. So I got two purse boxes at $19.99 plus $10 shipping. Okay. Here's a little card. All right, first thing out. Oh, looky, looky. This is Kate Spade. This is a little, it's probably just a shoulder bag. I don't really know if this would fit. Oh yeah, it fits as a crossbody. It's like a little phone case crossbody. Put your ID in there or something. I've never seen one of these before from Kate Spade. Phone test. Okay, it works and it zippers. That's cute. Huh. I like this. And it's super cute cheetah. It's in really great condition. So let's do, um, let's do $35. That's really cute. Okay, next we have What is this? Latique? I don't think it's leather. Let me see. Nope, 100% polyvinyl. I guess these go on the bag somewhere. All right. Um, all right, so let's let's see. I mean, it's cute. It's like a uh, beige. It definitely needs a good wipe down, but I like the handles. I like how they're uh, like that brown and black and beige snake print, bigger handles. Um, it's in really great shape. Like I said, it just needs a wipe down. There's the brand, Latique. You have a zipper pocket and slips on the other side and it's clean. So I think these may be just tied on the sides if you want them to. So I'll keep them in the in the bag, but the you know they're they are a little mangled. So I mean, okay, I mean this isn't bad. So let's do um let's do 20 bucks on it. Not bad at all. Okay, I'll take it. Then we have, I see a wallet. Ooh, a coach wallet. This is pretty. Beautiful Christmassy holiday color, like a dark purple. Absolutely gorgeous. 
really good shape. Pop open the top here. So you have your slips, card slots, ID, and then what is this? This is a zipper pocket compartment here. Yeah. I mean, this is in really nice shape, you guys. Beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. I like it. Um, let's do 40 on this one. How gorgeous is that? Just kidding. Okay, what else? Looks like we have maybe one more, two, two more. So, okay, this is Chico's. It is brand new with the tag. Makes a great gift. Um, it just has a $10 price tag on it. Um, and it's just a little tote. It's a little um, cheetah tote bag. I can't believe this is only $10. This is really nice. You have the little slips on the top there. Wow. This will make a great bag to keep in your car in case you forget a reusable bag. Because I don't know about you guys, but in New York, they charge you for bags at the stores if you don't bring your own. So um, this would make a great bag to leave in your car if you forget your bag. So um, I guess I'll just do eight on it since it has a $10 price tag and I got to give you guys a deal. So $8, super cute. And there's still one more. This is a Kipling. Um, okay, so it's like a little beige crossbody, or you can adjust it to be a shoulder or crossbody bag. You do have the little guy. There is some discoloration right here. But other than that, it looks good. Zipper pocket on the top. Nice. So really the only issue is the discoloration on the side here. So um, for that, I'll just do $10. Okay, so that was great. Okay, so I got two boxes and I got one, two, three, four, five items. So that means one box came with three items and one box came with two. So really great. I'm super happy with everything that I got. Um, even if I had just gotten this, I mean, it's in like new condition, but I got the Kate Spade. This is a pretty interesting purse, really great condition. The brand new Chico's and I mean, the Kipling had a little issue, but I'm fine with it because the rest of the bags are really good. Um, so that's awesome. So let me know what you guys thought of the two boxes um, and make sure you give me a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for watching. Check that sold list before you email me. And um, yeah, that was, that was a pretty good one. All right, Goodwill. So uh, thanks again, guys, for watching. Thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and we will see you in the next one.